Hey there, Brewberries, what's up, and welcome to another episode of our Revenant playthrough on Guild Wars 2. Uh, as you can see, I'm uh, quite a bit higher level than last episode. Um, so, uh, they've introduced this whole Adventure Guide Volume 2 type of stuff, and it gives you a crap ton of experience. I was literally just, I'm still in the first area, but I've just been kind of exploring through here. Oh, I missed a couple here. Hmm, we'll have to get those. Um, I've just been exploring around doing some of the hearts and stuff and just have gotten to level 19. So before we get to level 20, uh, because I know every 10 levels is a story progression, uh, or at least I believe that's how it is, if I remember correctly. Uh, we're going to jump into the actual story today. Also, look at Walter. He's looking pretty fine, isn't he? Yeah, I got because of I think think because of the release on steam they gave away some things or maybe it was a like a, a daily sign on thing uh, i got a a free little like skin thing or actually this isn't entirely different this isn't technically walter but he, i mean he looks like walter i think uh is it up there i think it's up there um so i am uh very excited to start this story because i've never done the char story and I'm actually really digging the just general like landscape of the char. It's very cool. But let's check out their main city, the Black Citadel. Um, and yeah, I'm going to probably try to make this episode just a slight bit shorter. Primarily because I have a little bit of a head cold right now. And so it's uh, kind of got a slight pounding headache currently, so just don't want to wear my headphones super long. But let's start this storyline, Chain of Command. We're in the Blood Legion. Uh, hello there, Wall. I am going to go past you. You made it, but I think we're the only two left. Well, Dinky, uh, do I talk to you? Empty bunks, empty rooms. Why'd our whole warband have to die? Didn't they like it here anymore? Closper, area of the Maverick, what happened to us out there? What's Steelbane's problem? Why take it out on me? What about how he was a warband's lieutenant? Did he die too? Uh, let's do this. Steelbane happened after you went in. He split us up. I saw the others die. I'm going to miss them, me. You'll stay with me though, right? All the way, Dinky. I'll always be there for you. All right, let's go. Yep, or not. Well, look who finally came back. When Steelbane gets done with you, you'll wish you died with the rest of your warband. As if I cared what you think. Who are you? And why are you breathing at me? Sorosi breaks steel. Steelbane recruited me, along with the others, to rebuild the warband. Wait, what? He's recruiting without asking us? Yeah, because you're dead, remember? And probably better off that way. Report to Steelbane in the barracks, quick, or you'll be in for a beating. I ain't dead. Oh, also, got some new abilities since I am level 19. Uh, have some cool stuff going on. So we've got this, our Vengeful Hammers is just a thing that channels this goes down. So it stays on as long as I have some of this uh whatever this is which is kind of cool and it does a little bit of damage and it gives damage resistance which is really cool and uh then it also does income oh it gives us incoming condition damage more of it but oh well uh, and then we've got this creative stone road which is pretty cool gives us fortification as well i believe or stability yeah so we can't be like stunned knocked down etc and then this guy i can't show you because i need a target but it's pretty cool. Uh, it all gives us like a little bit of a chain and then we take damage, less damage from whomever we just chained. So it's very cool. I think, do I have one more? Uh, no, I don't. Okay. And then we have this other stance that I unlocked. Don't have anything on it. This is the demon stance. Yeah, demon stance just changes our healing. From what I can tell, the demon stance is more about healing uh, and kind of resistances and stuff. Um, I can't quite tell. So uh, right now, let's see. I want to switch to this. This is our the other one that I went into first. Legendary Assassin Stance. Uh, we get this. Summon Enchanted Daggers, which every time I attack, one of them goes off and hits, which is really cool. 
Uh, dodge backwards is just like a, a dodge and then gives us fury. And it also removes conditions and stuff, which is really cool. And then empower yourself with Shiro's incredible speed and destructive prowess. So every time we attack, uh, and this is another one of those, like the hammer being a channel type of thing. Can I switch? No, okay. So I cannot switch and have that active, which is fine. But that just gives us a little bit of speed and then makes our uh, attacks. Actually, I'm going to discover all these locations while I'm here because this is a story instance, so I won't be able to access it normally. But I will do that when you guys are not watching. Oh, and I had to turn on my little version of this. Look at this guy. Isn't he cute? Oh, I love him. Okay, let's go with the story. Legionnaire, looks like some sewage just floated in from the battlefield. You, you get my best soldiers killed and then have the nerve to stand there stinking up our barracks with your cowardly musk. I didn't do anything. I got them killed. Tell me something, boss. Who's in charge of this outfit? Who is giving the orders? You. Watch your tongue, soldier, or I'll have it removed for insubordination. Great. Teach this piece of waste how to address a legionnaire. With pleasure. Do I have to beat him up? Are you what's happening? Ah, okay. Well here, how about how about you just blow right down there, you absolute buffoons? Yeah, I'm not going to bleed because uh, I'm too good for you. I have returned to fight at your side. Who is returned? Oh my gosh, what are you guys doing here? Here, how about, how, how about you take a little bit of a hammer there? Oh my gosh, there we go. Sorosi ble bleak steel. I don't know why exactly. Oh, here, ha, ha, here, here you go. Here, we'll do uh, do some of this. And oh, she moved. Rude. Okay, let's get a little bit of poison going. Ah, see, I can beat the crap out of all these people. They're they're babies. Stand down, all of you. Stand down now. So. You fight your own warband better than you fight the enemy. Go on, get out of my sight while I figure out what to do with you. There's a load of supplies over at Telerain's. Bring them to me. Double time. It's the only job you're fit for. Screw this up, and I will use your hide as a doormat. Understood? Understood, boss. I've got a little bit of an attitude. What'd that guy do to me? All right, so we got to leave the instance, but I'm going to get the, uh, the little things. Looks like the story is over here in the Plains of Ashford. And oh, I'm actually pretty close to being done with the Plains of Ashford. That's pretty cool. Uh, it is. It's actually really cool right now. There are a ton of people playing. And wow, did I just wreck those script? My goodness. It's really cool. Um, it's just cool to be kind of like playing this as there's a ton of people. Uh, I don't know. It's kind of it's it's just cool. I think. Let's do this. And that's a cool piece of artwork there. Chain of command. This is stupid. Supplies go in the supply depot. Why can't we just leave them there? Well. Is this dude dead? What the? The rest of your warband defected voluntarily. Don't be stubborn. Why fight for blood when you can cook for Flame Legion? Females have it easy with us. You want me to desert and join you so you can demote me to fry cook? Please! I've killed a hundred males twice your size. Fall in line or fall on a blade. I don't care which. 
No luck trolling for recruits at the pig farm? <laughs> you Flame Legion stiffs must be desperate. I came here for supplies, but this is a lot more fun. If it's fun you want, recruits, let's send Blood Legion a message. Bury these idiots and destroy those supplies while you're at it. Well, maybe not. It's cool, this uh, little force field thing I've learned it gives uh, an area of effect and ah, death, death to you. Let's switch to the staff. Let's do this. And well, I do like the staff. I picked it back up a little bit. And uh, what is number four again? Ah, yes. Uh, let's do this. Give ourselves a little bit of fortification or whatever it's called. Um, and then we'll just uh, run at you. Huzzah. Oh, that dude's so dead. Very well. This is what you have my attention. Oh, excuse me. Oh, he's a prey there. Well, it's too bad because, uh, oh, I missed. Never mind. How about you just sit right there? There we go. I really like the hammer. Like you can disrupt us, you fool. What a wombat thinking you can knock me down. I have my road. Best quartermaster in the legions. Whatever you needed, he had it. How's it going, lady? My whole war band deserted for the promise of power. Never thought I'd see something like that. I have nothing left but my life. If you'll have me in your ranks, it's yours. We need soldiers. And you can clearly handle yourself in a scrap. Welcome to the war band. Just be warned, my legionnaire is going to drown us for losing those supplies. I hope you can swim. Don't worry, I can hold my breath for a long time. I'll take punishment over death or being a gladium. Lead on. Nice. Well, lost the supplies, but whatever. What type of gloves we got here? Power, precision, vitality. Well, I'm just going to go with power. Generally, I feel like the thing you do early game is you go for power. Uh, can't use you. Can't use you. Can't use you. Oh, a die. What's this? This will die. Cool. And uh, let's leave the instance. But generally, I think you just build power early game just because your PVE and it, like actual builds don't really matter. OK, so it's right here. So let's go here. Bada bing, bada boom. Uh, that's generally what I do. I'm actually approaching level 80 on my Necromancer, which is pretty honestly exciting. It's the first time this will be the first MMO that I have ever gotten a character to like, quote unquote, max level. And I, I know that's not necessarily max level because you can like infinite. What is this? decade armor smith interesting um that you can like you, you just constantly level up and you get higher and higher and whatever um but it's cool because this is like this is, I, i've had guild wars for so long and uh oh that's down below okay this is down below as well or is it up above that is the question um but it's just really cool. And I'm hoping that I can get this character up there as well, uh, up to level 80, because the Rev I think it's the Revenant is the great sword user for this. Uh, maybe he's even higher up. I don't even know, man. Um, oh, that person just launched himself off the edge. <laughs> can he jump all the way down? That'd be awesome. Okay, is this 
Is this still further down, man? Aha! I found it! <laughs> what a way to get down there. Okay, let's do this. Let's keep going. Time for a promotion. Can't fool me twice. This time, I'm ready for Steel Pain's bad attitude. Yeah, his bad attitude. Because he's a, a butthole. Ooh, do we get a fight in an arena? That'd be cool. I will make it quick. Well, well. If it isn't the brave soldier that aided me in Baradin's crypt. Good to see you again, Tribune Brimstone. If you'll excuse me, I need to speak to Steelbane. Reporting in, Legionnaire. Teller range was compromised. Crawling with Flame Legion. The supplies were destroyed. In other words, you failed. Again. By the claw of the con Earth. Give me one reason why I shouldn't just kill you now. Go ahead and try it. You don't have the spine. You're done, Steelbane. Either you step down as Legionnaire, or I'll knock you into the dirt myself. You want my job, you miserable little puke? Earn it. Get down there and fight. Show me what you've got, and maybe I'll show you how a real Legionnaire fights. Get around, troops. Watch me crush this little mutiny and teach you all a lesson in respect. Respect is earned. To the arena. To the arena. Right. Just me? I don't like that I'm standing on this thing that looks like it opens. But I do love me a good arena. Hmm. Okay, there's there's quite a few here, quite a few here, and dodge. Uh -huh. Bonk. Oh, I'm stuck. Okay. Oh, these guys are really easy. Not bad, soldier, but it's not over yet. Let's see how you fare against the arena champion. Oh, I get to face the arena champion already? Cool. Fool. This is it, soldier. Last round. Victory or death. Let's see what you got. Defeat the giant devourer. Oh my gosh, you're ugly. Oh, you want to launch projectiles at me, huh? Well, you can't get through here, sir. Idiot. No! How about this? You get hit by about a million different things. Yeah, you can't hit me. I've got a hammer and I know how to throw it. What a wombat. All right, sir, y'all gonna gang up on me now? Expectations. What do you say, Steel Bane? Uh, he 
so impressed he's speechless. <laughs> now get in that ring and fight, Steelbane, or I'll split you open myself. You're scary. Uh, yes, sir. Tribune. I can't hear you, Legionnaire. Yes, sir. Uh. Challenge Steelbane. This soldier's willing to fight to the death. Steel Bane. To be impressed, Tribune. I am going to make an example out of this whimpering cub. Are you? Oh, you've got a hammer. Well, so do I. Ho <laughs> ho! Look at that. Oh, I dodged you. I jumped. I dodged you again. Oh, I dodged you again. Oh ho! Look at that. I dodged again. Oh, I dodged. Oh, I <laughs> I'm a slippery one. Oh, I didn't dodge. I dodged, but I uh, didn't dodge. I dodged again. Oh, does me dodging. I know this is exciting gameplay for you guys, just me dodging and throwing hammers at people, but it's pretty Stop. fun. I surrender. Don't kill me. I can still be of use to the Blood Legion. He's done, soldier. Either he lives to continue serving the Corps as best he can, or he dies in the name of Legion discipline. Either way, the decision's yours. Kill him or cast him out of your warband. Wait, can I just put him under? I feel like that's the ultimate decision. Make me sick, nauseating little whiner. Crawl away and take your shame with you. What what was best for Steelbane, you mean? You started this, I'm finishing it. Don't do it, I beg you. Let me live. Sure, I'll let you live. I'll be a nice guy. I'm gruff, but I'm nice. Steelbane wasn't fit to command. Congratulations on your promotion, Legionnaire. Look at how surprised I'll I am. I'll build this warband and live up to your trust, Tribune. I promise you that. Your first duty is to replenish your warband with honorable Gladium. Earn their trust. Understood. Any recommendations? Fie on the Wraith and Sour Doomsday. Both are good soldiers who've fallen on hard times. I'll give you a full briefing when you're ready. Report to this dude. I'm ready for it. Tell me more about Fion Wraith. Fion's warband spent decades in Ascalon hunting ghosts until they were caught in an ambush. Only Fion survived. He's a hardened veteran, good with the blades, more stealthy than you'd expect from Blood Legion. A little old, perhaps, but still kicking. Sounds like what he needs. What about the source? What about the sour? Sour is a talented necromancer. He was trained for covert ops until his warband found him meeting with flame shamans. They accused him of treason. I suspect he was just over eager. Hmm. Ready to choose. Soar, Doomsday, or Fion Wraith? What do we want? Necromancer or rogue type person? Hmm. Let's... Do Bion. I like the rogue. So a sword, an axe, or a staff. What is the staff difference? Healing power. Okay, our staff is just much better. So I guess maybe we do the axe. Sure, we'll do the axe if we switch up what we do, but let's get out of here. All right, let's see what we got from these little baggies. A focus can't be used, right? Yeah, no, can't be used. Can't use the spear gun. We can use that. This is just better. Okie dokie. Let's uh, get rid of you. Get rid of you. Get... Uh, I got rid of the axe. Oh, well, looks like we're not using the axe. Just got a little uh, happy there. Too happy. Uh, let's use this. Let's consume all of the luck. 
And we could do the XP boost, but it doesn't really matter. All right. So what, where is the story taking us? Over here. Ah, okay. Very good. Well, I've already been over here. And who knows, this episode may end up being normal episode length. The waypoint you selected has become contested. Okay, well, that's fine, because, oh, this one became contested right as I was going. That's fine. We're right near it anyway, so. How much, uh, nope, this is the pets tab. Let's see, equipment. What do we got? We don't have legit anything. Nice. Okay. We need a better hammer, honestly. Let's see. Ah, right here. Enter the instance. The end of the line. Darn it. Nat, go away. Killed it. Dinky, what you doing? Speak to Fion the Wraith. Let's go, Fion. Uh, let's get a little bit faster here. Oh, that is the exact opposite direction. Get moving. I really like this ability just because it makes me faster. All right. Hey, Fion. You're old, but I wanted you anyways. Fie on the Wraith. Ritlock Brimstone sent me. Ah, my old friend Ritlock. He must want to ask one last thing from me before I die. Not quite. He and I both want you to join my war band and leave dying till much, much later. Come with me and start a new life. New beginnings are for the young. I'm old, and I only have one thing left to do. Slash Warmaster Kalar's throat. Unless you can put down a ghost for good, Warmaster Kalar will just come back again. My comrades howl for justice from their shallow graves. I'm not leaving here without evening the score. Then we'll purify this crypt in their honor. If you survive, you join us. If not... Then I'll come back as a ghost myself and keep killing these Ascalonian devils forever and ever. Fair. My war band died too. I'm sad. But the boss is making me better. Are you talking? Come on, Dinky. The leader makes all the difference. Dinky? Yeah. It's a lot easier to be alone if you're with somebody. I'm, uh, oh! I thought you guys were going to move. You can't get through. Woo! Look at them dodges. I did not dodge that, though. I find it so interesting. The Let's just uh, knock you down. Let's hit you. Dodge. Oh, so if you hit that, like, immediately, right as you are... Uh, get a couple double hits going. The nice thing about this ability is... Your striking foes, uh, you hit them an, an additional time, which is pretty cool. Are we going this direction? Yeah, we are. Okay, I figured. We ain't skulking field mice like those ash maggots. Take this. An enchanter? It's too bad your spells don't go through my shield. Bonk. Wait, so if I use my staff in the, the multi-hit thing, does that mean the spinny spin hits four times? It's kind of interesting. Let's see. Kind of looks like it. I do like the staff. It's pretty cool. Bonk. Oh my gosh, something hit me. My gosh, what in the world hit me? This is a healing spell? Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Summon enchanted daggers that will attack as you attack, siphoning life. Okay, so we've got a healing spell baked in to that. I did not know that was our healing spell. Okay. I thought this healed, but does this only heal allies? 
Uh, okay. Oh. Quack. Alright, let's see how much healing this does. Okay, so it's pretty... It's a fairly effective heal. It's not crazy, but it's effective. Metal bar, don't care. We're going this way, right? Uh, seems like it. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got hit. So it's not a crazy heal. Honestly, I think I genuinely prefer this over the others. Let's see. Let's do this. What are you throwing? Are you throwing something at me? We. Oh, I, you move. Why would you move? And I do like when I have the four ability activated and this i actually have more healing there just seems like more healing active uh, let's do some row uh or not do a little bit of roadway action here you can't knock me down Yeah, you just have a little bit more... A little bit more control. I can attack the statue? Why? It's not doing anything. That's kind of strange. How much healing does this give? Heals about 10. So it's not crazy. My gosh. Some of these things hit like a truck. Jiminy Christmas. Yeah, I don't have a ton of armor. I definitely need some better armor. I think my armor is pretty bad. Uh, Warmaster Gaylor. Okie dokie. Oh, you're over here now. Let's turn this off since we're ranged. We don't necessarily need this. And we'll throw a little bit of roadway down. We'll jump, hip it hoppity, hip hop hop, and then we'll knock him down. Okay, jokey, or we're not going to. I can't see a freaking thing. All I can barely see is him. And whack. Let's see if we can kill him with this guy. Ha ha! Bonk! Curfud. Oh, it's very misty. All right, let's talk to this guy. Maybe now my brothers and sisters can find rest in the mists. You silence Kalar. They'll find satisfaction in that. Maybe this old cuss has a few fights left in him. You still have room in your ranks? I do. Welcome to the warband. Nice. Huzzah! What did we get? Better armor, that's good. So power, precision, vitality. We'll go with power for now. I've heard vitality is good. What does vitality do? Let's see. It's probably the little health uh, increased by vitality. Okay, so that makes sense. So this gives more health, but I think the better armor is just going to be more useful. But I could be wrong. I don't know. Finished with that. Nice. And we leveled up. So we get condition damage, power, toughness. Let's just do more power, of course. More power. 
Okie dokie. Enter the instance. Hopefully this will take all but a few minutes and then we'll be done. Those are... If that door shut on you, uh, it'd be terrifying. Good news, Tribune. Fi on the Wraith has joined my warband. Well done, Legionnaire. And just in time for your next assignment. Rage Steel Tongue, one of Steelbane's thugs, has become a problem. After you took over, he joined the Flame Legion. He's determined to bring you down at any cost. I'll drag him back to blood by the scruff of his filthy neck. No, there's a time for mercy, and a time for mercy killing. I'm not giving Rage the chance to betray Blood Legion twice. Then we'll give him a real torch party. Good. Meet me down by the Citadel gates when you're ready to deploy. Dismissed. Okie dokie. Okay, this will be the last bit, I think, for today's episode. Let's talk to you. At ease, Legionnaire. Ready to get started? More than ready, Tribune Brimstone. What's our next move? That mongrel toady, Rage Steel Tongue, was spotted in this area. Start with those cattle ranchers. Find out why they're here and if they've seen anything unusual. Get moving. Sir, yes, sir. Let's hear it. Watch your step around my stock. They're harmless, not housebroken. Why are the cows here? Some legionnaire came to the ranch and ordered me to herd them into the citadel, and when a legionnaire orders me to herd my cattle into the citadel, I herd my cattle into the citadel. You know which legionnaire. No, never seen him before, and he didn't give a name. Helped with a few packs, though. Did a passable job, but it sounds like he may have mixed some tools in with the feed. I'll need to examine those packs. Seems like everyone wants to poke around my cows today. Help yourself. Of course I'm gonna be digging around. Beast pack smells. Smells. The beast burden smells of gunpowder and oiled metal. It's also ticking. Get out of here. You gonna explode? Don't blow that guy up. Oh my god. You blew the darn dude up. Okay, you're ticking. Get out of here. Kerpow! You know, if I wasn't looking at a big pile of cow chunks, I'd be laughing. Laugh later. Right now, I need to know where those Flame Legion imposters went. They headed deeper into town. You'll find them if you go that way. Lead the way, Legionnaire. Rage just got promoted from Mongrel Toady to serious threat. Those exploding cows make me hungry. <laughs> exploding cows make me hungry. So where is he? Oh, over here. Okay, got it. Die, rat! Or not. Gnarl Snagtooth. Another inspection? Like I told the last guy, the defenses still have a way to go, but we're making progress. This is no inspection. Have you seen an unfamiliar officer? I didn't know the legionnaire who inspected our supplies, but he knew procedure and had the right uniform. He complimented me on my vigilance, seemed on the level. Drop that crate and step back right now! Oh my god. Bop. Oh my gosh, what's with these flame dudes? Whoa! Fire. Fire I don't Fire need watch. that. What is even hitting me? My gosh, dude, I get hurt so quickly. 
must have flame eyes. We have intelligence that could be planning something. This might be a strike of opportunity. Come on, let's move. Okay, let's see if this works this time around. Soldiers staggering around in their skivvies. Either we're on the right track, or we miss the best party ever. Yeah, I already said that. Aha! This is better. This is more what's supposed to happen. Did you get the gear? Got it right here. This dude's crazy. Put it on and you'll have free run of the place. They won't figure out they've been infiltrated until the damage has already been done. It's over, Steel Tongue. I took down that coward Steel Bane. And now it's your turn. Just tell me one thing. Why? Why'd you betray us and join the Flame Legion? Too proud to serve your new Legionnaire? I had it all set. That coward Steelbane was the only thing between me and taking over this warband. Then you came along and beat me to it. Yep. At the end of the day, I don't care whose banner I serve under, as long as I'm the one giving the orders. Like right now, boss, I'm ordering you to die. So do we not fight the big bad dude? We just fight these guys? Oh no, there he is. Legion must be getting desperate if they're resorting to cow bombs. Desperation is a weapon, Legionnaire. If they're targeting our defenses, they're planning a major assault on the city. Tactically, a night attack makes the most sense. When it comes, I need you and your warband in the field. When the fighting starts, your orders are to maneuver behind their frontline troops and take out the rear guard. Without mages and artillery to support the main force, they'll never breach the Black Citadel's walls. It's an important job. Can you handle it? My soldiers are ready, sir. We won't let Blood Legion down. Good. Dismissed. And there we go. Rage suppression complete. Oh, a better hammer. And it is just significantly better. Aw, sunk. All right, Brewberries, that's going to have to do it for this episode. I know it actually ended up being longer than usual, but there was some weird nonsense going on with the story. So it wasn't interacting the way it was supposed to, but we got through it and we made it. Also, why is my hat green? I just realized. But regardless, I hope you guys have enjoyed. If you did, leave a like in real life, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Guild Wars 2. Oh, bye-bye.